Okay, so we are looking at our new song. I think it's, I think it's called Traffic Lights. I can't totally remember uh, what we called it on Thursday, but I'll run through it and um, exactly what's on the sheet. And then if you find that fairly easy, you can you can um, add some extra things, which I will demonstrate. Um, so it starts off with an F chord. Um, so the F chord, you've got your first finger, first fret of the second string. So it's second closest to the floor. And then you've got your second finger on the second fret of the fourth string. So the one closest to the chin. And the pattern is going like this. So you're going strum, strum, stop, strum, strum, stop. And you do that twice. So you go strum, strum, stop, strum, strum, stop. And you do it again. So I'm just strumming the F. If you want to make that a bit more um, tricky, so what I'm doing is I play the F and then I kind of just gently cover the string, so I'm not pushing down at all. Get this sort of sound, and also I'm doing like a, a kind of harder strum and then a softer one and that gives you a sense of movement so you got <laughs> okay so uh, that's the first part after that we're moving to our C chord third uh, fret on the uh, string closest to the floor the first um, string I'd recommend your third finger and then your second finger for an A minor which is second fret on the fourth string and you go between those like this Two, one, two, three, four is that. So it's one, two, three, four, C, C, A, A, C, C, A, A. Then we go back into the F. And then instead of going C, C, A, A, we go A, A, C, C, A, A, C, C. We'll do that a bit slower. A, A. Okay, so I'm going to play the whole thing quite slowly and feel free to play along. So one, two, three, four. F, F, stop. F, F, stop. F, F, stop. F, F, stop. And you would C, 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 A, A, C, C, A, A, C, C, A, A, C, C, A, A, F, F, stop. F, F, stop. F, F, stop. doing it with those kind of chuck sounds and so on okay so let's look at the next bit so with this we are um what are we doing for this bit uh, let me remind myself oh yeah so we've got an f and we're going one and two and three and four and okay just down, 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 down. And then we've got a D minor 11, quite a long name, but it's easier than F. All you do is lift up that finger, second finger. So that one's still there. So you get this beautiful chord. I really like it. I think chords that have really long names are often like quite interesting sounding. Um, so uh, a bunch of Fs, one and two and three and four, then lift your finger. And then you play your C, but you keep your first finger down. And then you lift up your first finger to get the C. So you get this really like cinematic sort of sound uh, that sounds like this. Um, I'll play it slowly. So one and two and three and four and F. Lift the finger. Put down the C. Again, if 
if you're finding that um, you're like, well, grand, I've got that straight away, then what can you add? Well, you can add some things called accents. So instead of it just being like one and two, right, you can add... So I'm putting accents on different beats. So say if I put an accent on the one and the three. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. So I'm strumming louder on certain beats. Just try loads of different ones. I did twice as long as you should on breath there, but you know what I mean. Just kind of like strum louder at some points. Experiment with strumming really, really quietly on others. So. it completely changes the feel of it um, yes I hope you're doing all right um, and um, I'll see you virtually uh, next week